Please don't forget to like this video and if you haven't done so already, click the subscribe button, then click the bell and then click all. Every like and subscribe helps us make more great videos for you. This video shows you how to get all these settings in one place on Windows 10 and 11. Now it's called God Mode and it basically, like I say, gives you access to all these settings in one place. This video shows you how to get it. So all you need to do is find an empty space on your desktop, click the right mouse button, okay, and then when this menu appears, go to New, and then go to Folder. Now, if you're using Windows 10, this menu might look a bit different, but you've still got New and you've still got Folder. So, like I say, right click, then go down to New, and then go across to Folder and left click Folder. Then once you've got New Folder up on the screen, you need to type in there the following. Now, it's God with a capital G, mode with a capital M, dot, open parenthesis, capital E, capital D, seven, capital B, capital A, four, seven, zero, minus eight, capital E, five, four, minus four, six, five, capital E, minus eight, two, five, capital C, minus nine, nine, seven, one, two, O, oh, four, three, capital E, zero one capital C close parenthesis and I'll post that in the description of this video if you need it so like I say it's God with a capital G mode with a capital M full stop open parenthesis capital E capital D seven capital B capital A four seven zero minus eight capital E five four minus four six five capital E minus eight two five capital C minus nine nine seven one two zero oh, four three capital E zero one capital C close parenthesis so and then once you've typed that in press enter or return on your keyboard and once you've done that you've got this folder with no name underneath it so just double click on that and there you go, you've got all these settings here that you can uh, fiddle with if you're a bit of a fiddler on uh, Windows. So you've got loads of stuff there, loads of extra things all in one place for you to uh, make changes to your Windows. So there you go, I hope this guide helps. And if you liked it, don't forget to hit that like button. If you think your friends, your family, or your work colleagues might like it, then don't forget to share it on your social media timelines. And if you wanna find out about all my latest videos, then hit that subscribe button. Thanks very much for watching. You can follow me on Twitter, at CWTech. That's at CWTech on Twitter. And don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel. Just Google Chris Waite YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.